Hey guys, welcome to One Makeup Studio where we want to sharpen new video production skills in as little time as possible. So, I am a podcaster or a musician and someone who want to make an audio spectrum just like Clap Nation. Then this video tutorial is just for you and in this particular video, I'll show you how to create an audio spectrum just like the Clap Nation in Adobe Premiere Pro. That too step by step. Also, if you don't have any software or a laptop or a computer, don't worry. I'll show you a super easy way to create this audio spectrum online on your phone or on your computer. For this, make sure to watch the video till the end and links are given in the description below. So, let's get started. First, open the search engine and type onemaker.eu in search bar and hit enter. This onemaker.eu welcome page. Click the music visualizer category on the top. You can also sort by free, newest, most popular and most viewed. So I am going to select the free one. Here you will find multiple types of templates. Select any one from this category. This is the one maker editor page. Here you can customize your whole templates. Let's start with uploading the logo. Click on the upload logo. Select your logo. Then open it. The logo should be transparent. Then click on the crop button. Click on upload image. Select your image and then open it. I am using a green screen background here, which will help me to remove background easily. To get some more customized options, click on the advanced setting. To upload an audio track, click here. Select your audio tracks and then open Waveform Color 1 and going with default. To change Waveform Color 2, click here. Change Colors 3, 4 and 5 according to your project. You can also change different video sizes from here. Then click on export and update video for finalizing your creation. Your video is rendering. To make HD video, click on make HD video. To change or edit something, click on back to edit. To download low resolution, click on download low resolution. So I am going with the make HD video option to make HD video. Your HD video rendering is started. To upgrade your plan, click here. And choose among yearly, monthly or lifetime plans to explore the creative world. To download HD video, click on the download icon. Here our 50% work is completed. Let's move on to Adobe Premiere Pro software for the further process. This is the Adobe Premiere Pro work interface. This is the source window. This is the project window. This is the timeline window. And this is the program window. If your workspace is different then you can easily reorganize your workspace from here. And you can also create a new one. So let's get back to our topic. Right click on the project window. Go to import and select your data. And then import. First, drag your BG clip to the timeline window. Your BG clip has no audio waveforms, so remove audio tracks. And to do that, first select tracks, then right click and then select unlink. Now hit on the delete button to delete audio tracks. The next step is to drag the audio spectrum clip to the timeline. Go to the effect tab and search for the ultra key effect and simply drag it over the audio spectrum clip. Then go to the effect control. Here you will see the ultra key option and all the parameters which we can adjust. Here the main one is the key color. You can select any color which you want to remove. So I select the dropper tool to choose my exact green color shade and then press OK. You will see the green screen has disappeared. If there is a need to do any other cleanup, like if you have some shadow or not perfect lighting, you can simply drop down the matte generation and adjust the things like shadow, tolerance, pedestal amounts, etc. After forwarding some frames in the video, we see some lighting shadow in the corners. To remove that just lower down the highlight. As you can see we've completely removed the green screen. And our final project is ready. To export this project go to file and click on export. Change your file name. I am going with the audio spectrum. Set your save location. You can change your video presets from here. And also you can change the video format from here. Then hit on the export button. <laughs> So that's how to make a music visualizer like Tap Nation and if you really want some more easy to follow and listen tutorials just like this, make sure you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time.